U.S. military brings down flying object over Lake Huron near Canadian border. Here's a summary of the article. We process your data to deliver content or advertisements and measure the delivery of such content or advertisements to extract insights about our website. You may exercise your right to consent or object to a legitimate interest, based on a specific purpose below or at a partner level in the link under each purpose. Your device can receive and send information that allows you to see and interact with ads and content. Personalized ads and content, ad and content measurement, audience insights and product development. A profile can be built about you and your interests to show you personalized content that is relevant to you. Personalized content can be shown to you based on a profile about you. Ads can be shown to you based on the content you're viewing, the app you're using, your approximate location, or your device type. This post received a score of 52,000, with an upvote ratio of 91%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Did anyone get a picture? It's crazy how in the old days this would be a UFO conspiracy theory but now we have HD cameras in everyone's pockets and the world governments and militaries are just openly like, You'll get out of my lawn, high-tension nation. The UFO stuff was a cover for our high-tech air stuff, not theirs. I wouldn't even rule out the possibility that the whole alien saga was invented by the U.S. military or secret service to cloak experimental planes and balloons. I lost count. How many have been shot down now? Only 95 to go. Fun Chinese prank. Release four spy balloons over America. Each one labeled with a number. One, two, four, five. Sit back and chuckle as America searches frantically for balloon number three. You joke, but that's legitimate military counterintelligence strategy. When you number things the enemy might hear about, don't number them in a way that lets them get a good count from it. That's how the Soviets numbered their Mosins. Spheres, cylinders, octagons. We're at war with shapes. Mr. President, initiate operation. Square hole. Okay, so the triangle goes into the Less than. Yep. That's right. The square hole. And the semicircle? It goes in the square hole. It's really saying something that the UFO subreddit is being more level-headed than 90% of comments in here? Ah, UFOs has actually been pretty good about debunking sightings with reasonable explanations for a while. Save for the occasional completely schizo posts, in order to discuss something as a potential unidentified flying object, You need to exhaust all possible identified flying objects and they're pretty good at that. Generally speaking I think someone who genuinely underscore wants underscore aliens to exist and for us to interact with them within our lifetime would exhaust all reasonable explanations before saying, holy shit, this is it. The people who you have to worry about are sunk cost fallacy victims. Edit. I'm leaving it. Fallacy lol. Man you don't have to be a dick about it. The fally of man. Pretty sure I played a man fally in WoW. It's always sunny in Philadelphia. So have they always been shooting things down, and we just never heard about it? Or is this all completely new? I don't think so. People would be all over it. From NYT just now. Edit. Source. Paywall. Not gonna lie the fact they were quick to call the other one a Chinese spy balloon yet not say anything about the others other than refer to them as objects is pretty strange. It is very weird TBH. All they have to say is, yep it's yet another balloon, or, it was an unidentified drone, or something like that. I mean let's be real, it's just going to be spy equipment, but why not just come out and say it? This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.